Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Sassy Sauce, and I can't pronounce the name of it, and Fair Maiden Poppy. I'll also be using Cheeky Princess Charming Jumbo 8 Stamping Plate. Here is Sassy Sauce, and is it bad -a -ka -na -ka -na -ka? I don't know. Anyway, and it's a thermal. And here we have Fair Maiden, and this is Poppy. We're going to mix these up together. Well, we're going to pair them together. We're not mixing them up. But here we go with Poppy. That's probably a summer color or spring. I don't know. But we wear what we want to wear, right? So there we go. We're going to cap my free edge. Ta-da! And here we go with <laughs> the Sassy Sauce Polish. And I'm sorry I can't pronounce it. I, you know... <laughs> Southerners, we sometimes have trouble with stuff like this, but it looks like bad on ka donk. Bad on ka donk. Bad on ka donk. Maybe that's it. Anyway. <laughs> Hi, Woody. How you doing? So there we go. We got our first coats on, and then we're going to go in for a second coat. Look how ugh, shimmery pretty that is. Yay. I figured these would pair up well together. You guys will have to let me know what you think down in the comments. I do like them. Woody back again. It's going to be one of those manis. You can see that thermal's changing. The ba donk a donk <laughs> And I've made a mess up by my cuticle for sure with that one. But it'll be okay. We're prepared. We can handle it. Got Woody to help me. Look at that. Oh, he did such a good job. All right, so I'm going to top those with the INMs out the door. We're going to get these nails to dry down so that we can do some stamping. And I do like these two together. I, you know, I, I just, there was something like the shimmer and the thermal that worked with the other polish, the poppy. And I just, I, I couldn't resist it. I saw them and I was like, you know what? That might work. And there we go. Nice top coating. Covering that tip. And there we go. Here's a swatch photo. Not the best swatch photo. And here is Cheeky Princess Charming Jumbo 8 plate. And I'm going to use these pretty little hearts and bases loaded lacquer on the black. I got my two cube stampers from AliExpress out today and we're going to pick these images up this image up on these two stampers and we're going to fill them in little hearts I'm going to clean that plate with some pure acetone and then we're going to do another one cuz I am making two decals today that's the game plan Pick that up. There we go. All right, so I'm going to fill these hearts in with the Badonkadonk <laughs> Sassy Sauce Nail Polish, the Thermal. And I know it just kind of looks the same right now, but when it does the thermal change and stuff, I think it's going to look really good. And I am using my What's Up Detail Brush. I think it's Mermaid 01 or Mermaid O. I don't know. It's the one I've been using because it was still sitting out on my desk. <laughs> and I'm just kind of dabbing this in. It's, you know, with thermals, they change color as you, when you're messing with them. So we'll see what this looks like here in a minute. Had to get some more polish out on my mat <clears throat> so I could finish these up. And I'm just going to show y'all you know me doing this one I don't I don't think you need to see two I don't know it's the same I did them both the same let's flip that joker over and see all right pretty good pretty good I am going to use the super dry as my little wet base for these decals to stick to <coughs> This isn't really a sticky base or anything like that. It's just a wet base for that 
um, decal to kind of stick to when I apply it right here, right now. There we go. All right. Tap, tap, tap it down. And then now for the other one. There we go. I'm digging it so far. And now for cleanup. I have got some acetone in a little dampen dish off to the side. And we're just going to kind of melt the excess that's hanging over off. And it also helps melt the decal down to the nail a little bit. Go in underneath it. There it goes. I really like this. I thought this worked out really well using the, <coughs> excuse me, the accent or the, the thermal polish to fill in those that went on the orangey poppy nails. I don't know. Just, it worked for me. I liked it. I liked it quite a bit. All right. I'm going to top these with the smudge free top coat from Maniology. That way I don't smear this design. And once that's dry, I'll be topping it with my posh top coat. My glossy, fast dry top coat. And this is, this is going to be it right here, y'all. Oh, I love it. I love thermals. Love playing with it. So much fun. So, so much fun. Capping that free edge. Very nice. All right, and I decided to go ahead and put some posh top coat on the other two nails. Well, three nails. The other nails that just got painted with the thermal. Well, no two. I did poppy on my thumb, but I didn't do a decal for it. <laughs> anyway, here's my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me a comment down below. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.